Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode. I am here in, uh, the falls right now. Um, we had to make our way here on foot so I could go into the lair the manual way so I could turn in this fr <laughs> So I get the, uh, this part of the quest, I believe. At least I hope so. I hope I don't have to redo this now. So... I came all the way over here. This is the last part I need is to come to his lair, so I think I should be able to talk to him. We've already done the dialogue and stuff for here. So I think all I need to do is go talk to Zen. Um, and we're done. Hopefully. That's the plan, at least. And then we can continue on with the story. Um, we have... What the heck is this? I already did this quest. Whatever. We have a... Uh, where was the final thing here? Was it like... There's a certain allies here. Uh, witness the events of Zin's trial. Did I accidentally do that by mistake? A sigh. Oh, I have a speed boost. Why am I manually walking there? So I believe I should just be able to run over here and talk to Zin. Why, look who's here. I believe I already did this dialogue earlier, so... Yep, as promised, here's for a compensation for your service. Perhaps I'm underestimating you. I mean, I'm happy my fifth year abilities rang true. And he gives us some automaton uh, stuff. All right, now we need to go witness this trial again. And I don't appear to be able to uh, abandon it. So we're going to cheat and go to a different character. Because <laughs> I think my sin should be at this part as well. There we go. Speak with the Assyrian clerk at the Tarnished Coast. Perfect. So my sin is actually at this exact same spot in the trial, or in the thing. So it looks like you can skip the trial by just going in and going out. Um, let me just quickly grab some heroes. Leandra. Uh, where do I put my PvE daggers? Right there. Uh, do I have a PV build saved? I do not. Um, just do one really quick. It's not going to be perfect, but I don't really care. It doesn't need to be great. Boom, 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 boom. Um, grab that. That. That, uh, and then critical eye and our three dagger skills, and we should be good to go. Boom, boom. Where are you? Am I blind? There you are, jagged strike. All right, perfect. Problem solved. Talk to the Assyrian clerk here. All right, here it is, the trial of Zin. It's it's a lot of dialogue. You're finally here, Buka. Per a certain custom, no one may speak to the council, defense, or prosecution for the duration of the trial, so quickly conclude any business you have with them. Except to the witness area when you're ready, begin. The session of the Arcane Council is called to order. We are here to adjudicate Azuri's charges against the Goldmancer Zin, also known as Zin the Amazing, the Zintastral Zim, Supertagious Zin, in Intruder Zim, and Ahem, Mr. Zincompetent. <laughs> Zincompetent is great. Um, what, who calls me that? So obviously, yeah, this character is a rip on Invader Zim. That's Intruder Zim. <laughs> Everyone does now, genius. But I was the one who started it, if that's what you're wondering. Ula, enough, the charges against Zin are as follows. One, mathematical turpitude, gross fluxometry, the third degree, reckless investigation of mayhem without a permit, an overdue library tome. What says the accused? Oh, no, he's investigating without a permit, and he has an overdue, overdue library book. He's done. He's cooked. Not guilty on all accounts, except perhaps the tome. In my defense, by burning copy of Ula's Guide to Golemancy, I was doing a favor to young, impressionable, sir, and everywhere. 
Man, they got a game with destruction of government property. Scoundrel. <laughs> Hack. <laughs> you hear Biden? Nope. Cutscene. Ten minutes later. Dim wit. Income poop. <laughs> They're still going. 20 minutes later. Uh, I love this joke. This joke is great. It's in all kinds of popular media, obviously, from Switchbelt, but it's freaking hilarious. Oh. Ignoramus. Enough of this squabbling. Both you pipe down, or I'll have the militia. <laughs> Tweak your ears. Prosecution, your first witness. A persecution, excuse me, not prosecution. Den and Kron for the prosecution. Let the rest of it reflect. There are 32 witnesses here to testify. With that, the persecution rests. Objection, they cannot call the witnesses. <laughs> no need, everyone knows you're guilty. Den and Kran. Objection. Overruled in all fairness is in you are guilty and I've got research of my own to get to, to back uh, my own to get back to any witness for the defense before we convict you. Just myself. That's all I need. Hey, hey, ego Matt maniac. This is why he thinks it's okay to cause mass chaos and destruction without you filling in the proper paperwork in advance. Tell us in why do you think you're so much better than the rest of us? He's going to say, because I am. <laughs> I didn't say that. Oh, wow. But you think it Ula's a renowned goal answer, but you say your work is rubbish, or maybe you're just jealous of her. Now, why don't you answer the question? You want answers? We think we're entitled. You want answers? <laughs> we want the truth. You can't handle the truth. You imbeciles are deficient of co in the cognitive faculties requested to fully comprehend the truth, or you're intentionally trying to infuriate with your idiocracy so much that I lose my cool and lose the trial, but I won't. That is because I am. That won't work, and that is because I am innocent. Uh. I barely do list home, but you should thank me for that. I didn't have a permit for the homicide because uh, most of the mayhem was in human terry, so no permit was required. My math acts are immaculate, and the only flunkometry going on here is this trial. <laughs> ego maniac, ego and maniac. They're right here in the word. The prosecution arrested Den and Crane. <laughs> Objection, you're to, you already rested your case, you nimrods. That's enough. Let's hear your closing remarks. <laughs> Denon Kane, international incident. You all know this. His golems, his responsibility, simple as that. It's in his name, guilty as Zin, vote guilty. <laughs> Counselors dead and grain. The entire trial is a farce. Ula feels threatened by my superior golemancy and has called in favors to see me exiled. <laughs> uh, in the time for wild accusations is during oral arguments, not closing statements. You're out of order. <laughs> I'm out of. You're out of order. This whole trial's out of order. <laughs> That's a May. We are the Arcane Council, and you will abide by our rulings once we tabulate our findings. Someone's got to get me an abacus. Someone get me an abacus. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> 5.2708 seconds later. I wonder where that's a reference to. Oh, I'm back there in the corner. 
is the is fine to give the arcane council that Zim is guilty in charge of all accounts. Zim are hereby sends the banishment from Red Absum as subject lands for 10 years. Premature reparation will be punishable by death. As is customary, as the, may, uh, the convicted may now make a threatening speech. Is that brains? For brains, you think you've won a victory against me today, but you're sorely mistaken. Mark my words, the sentence is a greater punishment for you. You will be deprived of my genius that is for me, who will be freed from your ignorance. <laughs> this guy is so freaking silly. In conclusion, let me paraphrase my great uncle Fenwick. Fools, I'll show you all. <laughs> uh. Oh, we can actually talk to all of them. You know what? With so many so much gathered in one place right now is a good time to call a test that temporarily called my obliterator I've been working on. Whoop, getting the effects to be temporary has been much trickier than I had appreciated. Honestly, I'm not sure banishment is much about punishment. Sometimes I think a 10 year vacation from these bukas would be a welcome change of pace. That was too easy. I'm going to be relaying council, repaying council members through half of Zin's 10 year sentence. I'm sure, but it was worth it. <laughs> she did actually pay them off. <laughs> Never saw an Assyrian trial before, huh? If you liked it, you should read some of the classic Assyrian legal dramas To Kill a Moa Bird and Trial by Stone are two of my favorites. I really thought Zim was going to go with a you'll live to regret this rather than fools. I'll show you all. It's a matter of personal taste, I suppose, but I think the former is more traditional. <laughs> what a terrible miscarriage of justice. If I'd been running on that trial, it would have been one of the best miscarriages of justice of all time. <laughs> uh, anyway, um, oh, can we go talk to Zin? Oh, we can talk to Blim over here. Oh, it's not right. Ula wins again. She had my staff, you know, right a Surline staff. My staff moved to the cellar with the, the, the staff. That's not right. It appears I should have heeded Blim's warnings about Ula, but with all the mumbling, it's hard to make out what he's saying. He may be smarter than he sounds after all. I actually like this idea that Ula is, like, actually, like, kind of an ego villain <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> she kind of was in the story, but I just find it interesting. So I think that's it. Yeah, that's probably why this quest auto commit auto completed for me is because there's no like actual finish state. But that's gonna be all for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed the trial. I want to thank you for coming out, and I hope you have a great day. Bye bye.